to you about rust on all kinds of surfaces in the house. One of the things I get the most questions about are stainless steel silverware, especially knives. They get these brown spots on them when they come out of the dishwasher, and they're hard to get off. So what can you do? Well, if you have Barkeeper's Friend, that will work for you. Just take a damp paper towel, sprinkle some on, and make sure it's nice and damp. Then you're just gonna take that knife or whatever piece you're using, rub it back and forth, and you can see where it immediately takes it off. You're just gonna rub it back and forth, and now, look at that, no rust. Let's look at it one more time, I'll do this one. There you go, no rust on them at all. It's that easy. Just rinse them, wash them, you're ready to go again, and it does a great job every time. Now. If you're cutting the potatoes up to cook and you see some rust on something, rub it back and forth across your potato. The potato will actually take that rust off too. Now, if you have rust on hard surfaces at home, like your maybe your countertop or a floor, you can use lemon juice and salt. You just take lemon, put salt on it, rub it over that area, and the salt will come right out, and so will the rust with it. It does an awesome job. Now, if you have rust on other hard surfaces and you happen to have a potato laying around, put a little soap on it, any dish soap you want, and you're just gonna start and rub back and forth. I like this particular method for wood floors. If you have a plant sitting there, get a little rust from the container, it really does a good job, and it's very gentle on the wood floor, too. Countertops that have a more serious rust stain, you can use lemon juice, and cream of tartar. Now, where do we find cream of tartar? We find it in the grocery store in the spice aisle. And it's what keeps your meringue white, and so it actually works with the lemon to remove those stains. And it doesn't have to be a real lemon. It can be lemon juice. It works just as well. Now, if you have rust in your toilet, which of course yours is probably bigger than mine at home, uh, any kind of orange flavored breakfast drink or even lemon Kool-Aid will work well to take that out. A couple teaspoons in there, let it soak for an hour or two, use a toilet bowl brush on it, it'll clean it right up, swish, flush if the dog drinks out of the toilet. The worst thing that happens is he has orange lips. Now if you have pool decking, which I do right now with rust on it, I had a big heater out there when I moved it, had left a rust ring on my decking and I used Barkeeper's Friend. I wet the pool decking, sprinkle it on, and use a very gentle buffing pad to clean it off, and it took it right off. Just make sure when you use Barkeeper's on surfaces like that that you rinse them well. Now, if you have rust on white clothes, maybe you have a problem in your dryer or your washer, squeeze a little lemon juice onto it, just like that, and lay it out in the sun. If it's on colored clothes, you can put the lemon juice on it, but don't lay it in the sun. Now, products you can buy that you might want to use that I particularly like are Iron Out. Iron Out is in the aisle in the grocery store where you find the cleaning supplies, uh, things for laundry, things like that. Look for it there, use according to directions. It works really well. Then there's Wink, W-H-I-N-K, safe for people who have septic tanks, and that's something to think about, and Rust Magica. Any of these that you find in home centers, hardware stores, grocery stores, on Amazon will work equally well for you. If you missed this, go to queenofclean.com for a free printable copy of everything. Check me out on Facebook at Real Queen of Clean and on Instagram there too. And thanks guys for talking dirty with the Queen of Clean.